Lieutenant Henry O. Flipper arrived at Fort Sill in 1877. His first tour of duty out of West Point was with the Buffalo Soldiers. One of the duties uh, that was given him was to construct a drainage ditch uh, to drain this slough of swampy water uh, from a low area back north to the Medicine Bluff Creek. As the uh, spring rains came and the water rose and the water moved up into these uh, uh, low places and filled them up and then as the water receded it left these pools stranded. The water left stagnant in the pools created a breeding ground for mosquitoes and mosquitoes carried malaria, a major health problem for the post and the surrounding area. So the object was to drain those pools, but it couldn't be done during the wet season, it had to be done during the dry season. And so during the dry season, he supervised, engineered, uh, designed this drainage ditch to uh, drain these sloughs back to the creek. Each time the water went down, it would take all the water with it and not leave any uh, behind. Flipper's commander and others apparently thought the lieutenant's plan to defy gravity and have the sloughs drain back to the creek couldn't possibly work, but it did. Lieutenant Henry O. Flipper is credited with eliminating the source of malaria at Fort Sill. Part of Flipper's ditch still exists and is now on the National Register of Historic Places. I'm Billy Roadley with Centennial Stories.